Hello, everyone. So, and um, hi, Vitus. I actually have a question for you. Because it's a sequel to another game, should I play the first game first? Or should I just jump right in? I'm giving you the option. How are you doing tonight, by the way? And hello, everybody. Because I may have made a last minute purchase of your game. Intent. But I do hope everyone's having a splendid evening. I'm actually going to turn the music back on, I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't know why I got the music if I'm still talking to the stream and starting to see the screen. incredibly nervous but to be playing in front of a dub upper but that's just me I'm even stuttering that's how nervous I am yeah it's also my first time be back for a week two weeks so it's just like i am just not mentally prepared for this So I do think I am going to go with the first, uh, first game first or retroactively play the first one. Because I think I don't mind doing it either that way. But then again, I did kind of advertise the stream as being Twisty Land specifically. So we are going to do that, I think, and then retroactively play the first game after. Yeah, we'll look at both. Definitely. One second. There we go. So, uh, Cave of Illusions Twisty Land. From what I heard that this game is based is a uh, board game based game, which is always fun. I'm a big fan of board games. And this was made by Vitus, who is currently in the chat, also known as Mr. Timor, the creator of the Timor games, which I've actually remember way back in the day. Welcome back. So we're going to play the second games first, and then we're going to play the first game. Just giving a small introduction. So you were the developer of the Timor games. I actually remember those way back in the day. It was actually one of the first... Uh, any horror games that I've heard of, like, after Amnesia and such. Mostly remember them from Markiplier, like... <laughs> many years ago. And to anyone who also watched my old YouTube videos, you also might remember a game called Dia. 
which I've also played. It was a lot of fun. And there's also Scruncho, who I believe worked on Dia as well. And Trial by Fire, who I have actually followed on Twitch. Yeah, to be fair, I did advertise myself as playing the second game first, so I think we're going to do that, then play, this, then play the first game right after. <laughs> because I am terrible with planning ahead. <laughs> Let's begin. Oh, hello. Oh, she heard me. Oh dear, I know this is not your favorite place, but what happened is over. We have to move on, Sophie. Here, have some money. Go buy something fun. <laughs> Tonopoly. Twaster. Tongle. Tongs and ladders, sorry. Tongles. Battle snips. Grabble. I love these fake board names. And the train. I love this already. Tongles, yes. I have eyes also do what's this the pillar there. Yeah, Tongles is my favorite board game. Oh, this looks like fun. Yeah, sure. Well, he seems very excited. Immediate title drop. All right. So, how much does the game cost? It's my question. Ooh. Quirky Quacker Love Tunnel. <laughs> the rideable blue duck. Only befriending foes if you neglect that. Okay. One soul to play. I could always need it. I could always use a hand. Hi, Vince. Ron candy, caramel apples. Well, I know which one I would choose between the two. I would pick the one that isn't rotting, but that's just me. Oh, at least we don't have to wait in line. Boy, this is kind of empty. <laughs> Hi. Bye. <laughs> but that's a yellow duck. I'm looking for a blue one, right? Oh, well. I guess this will do. Now we can stand up. That's neat. So far, I really love the games used to cover a lot. I can no longer look at the card. I was like, it's supposed to be blue. Nope. Well, yeah. What gives? Game. Promising a boo duck and giving me a yellow one instead.
Gotcha. I was wondering if that was a bun masher. Uh. Yeah, I'm sure this won't end well in any way. So I can't interact with it. I guess we deactivated the barrier, perhaps? Yes, we did. Okay. <laughs> Oh, there's the blue duck. Hi. Oh, I guess. <laughs> quack, 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 quack. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Wait, what? Wait, did I miss something? Oh, I had okay. I'm sorry. <laughs> also, hi, kid. I didn't even see you sneak in there. Sorry about that. Well, back on the uh, not so fun yellow duck. I like the blue one. The blue one seems to be a lot more faster. You had a dream like this? In what way of like riding ducks or going through an abandoned amusement uh, amusement park? All right, so do we noted? Um, <laughs> pineapple fair. Guess I had a dream like this, but I would love to. My dreams are super boring, so... <laughs> quack, quack, quack! Oh, the boat. Gotcha. Yeah, see, he just zooms around that corner. Alright, so. Alright, not even gonna look back, just gonna keep running. I don't! I don't like the laughing at all! I like his quacking though. Oh, what is this? There we go. Yeah, sorry about dying that first time, guys. Just what I get for being a little curious. Bye! Quack, quack. Quack, 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 quack to you back. I tried to make the joke and I immediately butchered it. <laughs> Uh, where am I going? <laughs> Wait, so am I white or am I black? I am white. I'm guessing. And I'm guessing the uh, clown is black. Alright. I actually couldn't even read what the title was. It was something up. Tidy up carousel? Yep. A talking horse? If only he had a mute button. I wish the clown did too.
two weeks ago when you released the game. It's been that recent, huh? <laughs> no, I can't. That would have been fun. Oh, okay. You can never put your faith in people, dear. So take care of your toys. Maybe they will never leave you. Why have you them? <laughs> Hi. <laughs> You're in trouble now. Yeah? Am I? Wait, what is it? Do I get on a horse? Do I get on you? But I want to ride the talking horse! Wait. Yeah, hold up. There's a puzzle here. Wait, stream? Hold up. Wait, I was about to say the stream cut out? Oh no. I do not know what happened there. I'm sorry. Yeah, I guess that was just a small hiccup. Who needs hints when you have illusions? Please remember the card picture. Alright. I know that illusion, actually. I did not mean to open it again. Remember not to run, sweetie. Was well, a little too late for that. Oh, I did not notice there was no floor. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what happened because nothing happened on my side. Oh my god, I love those things. These I remember. Yeah, that was weird, because nothing happened on my side. I was just playing for the game, but I guess either my connection hicked up for a second, or Twitch did. But yeah, I figured out the let's just pretend it never happened and hope it doesn't happen again. Exactly. If it does happen again, let me know. Just type into the chat, because I could, I could still read chat as that was going on. That's a little disorienting. What is that even? What are these even connected to? Is my question. Oh, I didn't even get the choice to go down there. Unless I did, and I was just happened to be too close to it. Okay. Um. Okay. Sorry. We go on this side. Yep. Hold up. Um. I I think I keep pressing the.
Yeah, I'm concentrating. It does give you a nice wall to just relax for a second, at least. Okay. I feel like that something might be off the top. First, I didn't know how to be like this picture. Tried to make a huge ball because I didn't look at it. Yeah. No, I don't blame you at all. Alright, so it's like that. Is the top one correct? It is not, actually. One of them is not correct. I'm not trying to figure out which. The bottom right, bottom left one looks correct. Oh, uh, thank you for the fall events. As well as Vitus. A steadfast supporter. I am trying to figure out which one is not the correct one. <laughs> well, I apparently figured it out. I was I expecting another chase sequence though. <laughs> no, not this again. Get away from me, clown man. Whatever it is that you're laughing at is not funny. <laughs> Surprise. That's an awful surprise, Vitus. Why do you torment me so? Sucked on candy cane. Look at that tip. Oh, I almost just closed out the game. That would have been... No, I... Hold up. Oh. I... I want to stab the clown, man. Um... Uh, okay. Candy isn't free, Sophie. You can't just take what you want. You can if you can... Oh, I just saw... Of all things that could have happened, this was not what I was expecting. Alright, so it's obviously meant for combat. Okay. Wait, what?
Wait, I won that? <laughs> okay. <laughs> I thought I died. I was going to be like... Oh, he's ahead of me. I just noticed that. The candy gnome centipede. A deck of cards. Wow, how useful. Well, I have one in my hands. Adorable little robot man. Ah, oh, that one too, except it's purple and red. There's also a blue one there, but we're not going to talk about that, I guess. No, oh, they're just obviously <laughs> watching me. Something else is also ominously just looking at me, but I know I'm a little too late. There's... Oh, that's a counter. Okay. I was about to say, like, there's just a... <laughs> there's just, like, a giant empty space here, but no, it's a counter from earlier. Yeah, I noticed a frame. I'm not gonna talk about it. You know, everything would have been fine if we just went with Crabble memes. Instead of this. Or maybe some Twasser. <laughs> Can you get off my screen, please? I'm trying to get to the end. Did you just show up anyway? Shenanigan Shingles. I stopped reading the title of <laughs> all the games. And I do not know why. What? It is best not to dilly dally like a silly Sally. This advice saved me a change of grunders. Alright, <laughs> I'll keep that in mind. Well, I see what you mean. <laughs> yeah, I, I guess that's what I get for dilly dallying. Watch where you're stepping. Use your damn brain for one, Sophie. Oh. <laughs> I could have. I needed that earlier. Thank you. Love the hand. So, is that like a wire or is that like a tentacle or something? Because I think I noticed that earlier. It's the sound of a girl. Don't judge me. No, it, it must be a wire because it's connected to the lights. Okay. Oh, there is a jump. Okay. <laughs> I think I just missed him. You guys probably saw him better than I did. Oh, what? Listen, I, I'm just wondering. Also, I was walking on nothing for a second there. I'm not exactly sure if that was intentional or not. We just get sucked into this. Still on the wall, got to just get sucked into the board game. I want to go back. Nope, can't do that. <laughs> Lovely night outside. Forgot to save. Oh yeah, it is. I agree. Over here, it's all snowy and shit, though. Yeah, this is certainly lovely looking for us. 
Like I said, I do think that the strongest aspect of this game is its visuals. I love them a lot. Look up at the trees. <laughs> is there something I'm missing as I'm just walking through? Gotcha. Well, here is the titular Cave of Illusions, I'm assuming. Alright, sure. These are some huge stairs. can only lead to good things. Exactly. There's nothing to fear. It's not like this is a horror game or anything. I can't even see where I came up from. Also, do you like the, uh, the stair skip? Oh. Okay. I was wondering what the, uh, <laughs> the music sting was for. I'm assuming it was for this. It's gonna pop out, isn't it? Too deep of a cave, yeah. Oh, I thought it was a box. Or is it a box? Nope. Oh, it's cards. Mystery. Hint. Sophie? S Sweet child. You are finally here. Mommy is so proud of you. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Ring of fire. Sophie, how could you do this to your mother? You're supposed to hop through it. Oh, so now the cave's all wet up. Sophie Clark has been missing since September 2nd, 2020. She was last seen at the Rapture Center Mall. If you happen to... <laughs> hey, hey, Vonix, do you just <laughs> miss the game? <laughs> no problem, that was a lot of fun. <laughs> Although I have, like, very little context of it, I'm assuming, that would make more sense if I played the first game. Oh, Mr. Craven was the voice of the silly horse, gotcha. And the missing person art, okay. I still need to watch more of Mr. Craven, I always say this whenever a game brings them up, whether it was Lost in Vivo that I played, whether it was, um, whatchamacallit, um... Night the consumers, and then I never make good on that promise. But I, mean, I still miss the Mr. Graven part. Um, he was a horse. <laughs> the horse that I so desperately wanted to ride. <laughs> I hear just in time thinking that the camera fan was an intro scene. Gotcha. It's alright, but I did like this a lot. <laughs> yep, it will eventually... Keyword B, eventually. I've been kind of falling a little... <laughs> falling a little behind on that. But 
But it definitely will be uploaded at some point. A little fun. <laughs> he does have a little fun. It looks like a stump. <laughs> because of the way that was angled. And that will be Twisty Land. However, I did also buy the original game because I wanted at least some context, whether it would be now or later. Thanks, Nightbot. You were like a few seconds off. So that Ro didn't have to post that. <laughs> Welcome to a few minutes ago. Yeah, glad that Nightbot was able to join the party. A few minutes late. Yes, I am. That's the game showing up? Yes, it is. Okay. Although I do think that might be... Yeah, there we go. It was a little semi off. I'm sorry about that. Some titles turn on. Cool. So, uh, this is the original game. Now we can finally get some context. Part 1, The Drive? Sure. Let's just drive right into Looking the... My life, oh, okay. One could say I had everything going for me. My career was flawless. In fact, it was basically untouchable. I unearthed every truth and every lie. But there's always been one thing I could not shake. A memory. Or perhaps a dream. A whole town swallowed in conflict, surrounding one thing. That goddamn cave. The cave is not what keeps me awake at night. It is the fact that I don't even ever remember there being a cave. Trotter's cave. Yeah, blue car is nice, but it's no blue duck, so... That was one very My intense. My name is Leslie Jacobson, and I am an unexplained events investigator. If you think your cabinets are opening by the ghost in your house, or your catalyst disappearing from the extraterrestrial, chances are, I could probably disprove it. I don't believe in ghosts. The aliens that stealthily fly over us, I certainly don't fuck with Bigfoot. Everything has a purpose, and everything can be explained. Everything, except for Addy. When I was eight years old, uh -oh. my best friend disappeared. She's saying bullshit. This is what my head wants me to think, at least. The thing is, I was only a child. And the memory of the last time I saw her has been refracted upon years of questioning and everyone else's word against mine. It's been 30 years and to this day <laughs> I can't explain her disappearance. I can't explain her disappearance. You're hung up over that. I'm hung up over the Everything re reviewer over here. <laughs> That's probably how I looked when I was <laughs> Poogle. Okay, it's fine. Uh, Woodenville, New Hampshire is a quiet little town in a rural part of the state with a population of 396 people. Woodenville is surrounded by thick and lush forests with a wide variety of wildlife and natural beauty. Okay. 
<laughs> Just close out of it. Wait, what was it? Citydate.com. Okay. <laughs> Alright, yep. Get yeah, another police report. Police investigation. Friday, October 4th, 1991. First day, another police investigation was launched taking place in the Woodenville Forest for Eddie Baker, who has now been gone for five days. Police say they are working around the clock to find the eight-year-old and bring her home safe to the Bakers. Police encourage anyone who might know anything to set forward with tips. And the uh, Woodenville disappearances. Reality or myth? New Woodenville, New Hampshire, a small town hidden in the trees that barely has a population above a few hundred people. Have you heard of this town? You likely haven't. You can barely find it on any modern day maps. Of course, a town that small might take up more space on a map than it is worth, as most people passing by on major highways would not even hit close to Woodenville. The strange thing is, small towns do not just get wiped from maps when they still exist. It is almost as if people want to forget it is there, and they want you to forget it is there too. Who these people are are is hard to say, but what has happened in Boonville should not be forgotten. Small children, only girls, have been disappearing in the town as early as the 1940s. The exact number of victims is hard to determine, but based off of worn and dated papers, posters, it could be close to 20. When I visited this small town to research its strange events, I found no official documentation that mentioned the disappearances at all. When asking long-term residents, I was brushed off as if I had leprosy. I soon found that a natural rock formation in the middle of the forest was the only thing that kept the disappearances still alive, and even this is barely anything. A cave holding the name that I can find is snug fairly deep in the Woonville Forest appears as a source of great fear in the town, as many believe the cave has something to do with vanishing girls. This sliver of information was only bit was the only bit I could find through tiring research. Overall, this phenomenon has kept me stumped even till this day. What is this town hiding and what is hiding in its surroundings? Perhaps an alien landing zone? Or maybe the source of the sacrifice and cult that the town has protecting has been protected for years, where is the justice for these little girls? Well, we know it's not the aliens, because that is absolute bullshit. <laughs> As established earlier. <laughs> and we could disprove this. And we all know that cults are myths, so let's rule that out too. If you have any information regarding the Woonville disappearance, please email to the conspiracy gathering at gmail.com. Comments zero. Yeah, about as expected. <laughs> Sketchy websites always giving you viruses. I was about to say to Google. understand you much better if I can get familiar with the way you talk. Cortana! <laughs> Cortana! What are you doing? <laughs> Long nights and close families. Addie was the sister I never had. <laughs> we were inseparable, to put it simply. It is strange. Thinking about how she was a part of everything I ever knew. Until she wasn't. Just gone. Cortana had the fucking funniest bit there. I wish that was a joke I set up. <laughs> that was great. I remember seeing that empty opening. That grassy expansion where we used to run and play. But the thoughts of play were soon replaced by the thoughts of abduction. When the word got out that Addie that was me. search groups flocked desperately together to find her. When scrutinizing our area of play, I was thrown off to see a cave standing in its place. I asked my mother, when did that cave get there? Appearing perplexed, she responded with, Silly girl, the cave has always been there. Strondra's cave, like I said, the scariest thing in existence. Oh, okay. Uh, things I know for sure. Information on Woonville is hard to find. The disappearances are hardly talked about. The locals avoid talking about the cave or the missing girls. 
things conflicted by memory to investigate. Was my childhood imagination filling in holes of things I did not understand? Was Addie abducted or lost and murdered by natural causes? I vaguely remember something taking her. Did I forget there was a cave in my childhood town? I don't recall ever seeing a cave. Object, uh, objective questions. Is Louisville Forest simply a dangerous place to be as a child? Are there de valid answers to natural occurrences for death in the forest? Is a cave really a source of evil or simply a local story meant to blame for bad parenting? Missing people. There's even more people missing than I remember. Some of them have been gone for decades. Well, I can barely read them. Oh, we can read this one. Yeah, 1984. That's a little more. Yeah, 1977. Yeah, decades for sure. I forgot when the story takes place. Isn't it in like the 90s? That our friend went missing? Oh hey, it's the cave again. I searched as many times as my parents would let me. But as days turned into weeks, the search began to wither. Not long after that, we were moving out of town. Passing the see you soon sign, I wondered if there was anything I was actually sure of. I've always 93, it was 91, okay. Uh, here's our friend. To us, I've seen of Woodenville Forest. If you happen to know anything about the disappearance. Please contact. Yep. I'm sure they have been going. They've been working very well on this. No spiral staircase this time. It was land that said that Sophie disappeared in 2020. It's just all these business happened over many years. Yeah. Ooh, we found some bones. Bones in the cave. I found some bones in the cave. I'm not entirely sure if they could belong to a human. I was expecting it to be popping, like, right up. Well, is that it? Just bones? Of unknown origin? We don't just walk back, do we? Am I missing something? Oh. Well, something is happening. Yeah, I was getting this game in Twisted Land mix up for a second. Where am I? Oh. Did I mention to you before that I had the most beautiful smile? No wave this time? Just gonna stare at me? Oh, we're going down a waterfall. Okay. No, we're just going down to a hole. <laughs> I mean, a little more raised than just your head at that point. Oh yeah, journal. Okay. An altered reality. I'm not sure how I ended up in this place. It seems to be some sort of altered reality. I remember passing out and the faint memory of floating down the water source of an unknown area. The title boat I have awoken next to proves this fury, but the area does not look familiar. There was a humanoid looking creature steering the boat, terrifying to the eyes, but familiar to the mind. It was also a clown. <laughs> Wait, so the boat is saddled? No, oh, okay. Welcome to the Cave of Illusions. You're getting into it this time. Yay! Yeah, I know. He remembered it. He, he has a funny joke that he's not willing to tell us. 
I don't have the white key. So I can't go through the white door, right? Oh well, I don't have any keys at all. <laughs> Well, assuming it's on the ground somewhere. Or maybe back of the boat. Oh no, there's a little area here that I also can't find anything in. Every time that I see like a slightly different shade of that, I'm thinking that it's like Okay. Oh, I missed that somehow. Okay. And a letter, it looked like? Riddle number one. Pierce. Oh. Hateful night, a story of friend in need of fame and spite. Purposeless night, a yearn for sight. Relinquish your mind and feed upon the black and white. So it's true. She was taken. Uh huh. Well, can you disprove? Any supernatural occurrences happening? Because I am. Okay. I can't remember if it was a white or black door that I took. Oh, so this is where you stop swearing. This is where you draw the line. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm trying to figure out what's happening. I can't check the journal. Okay. What the? I can't remember what the what the uh, clue is. So it's just. Just... What the f I'm sorry, I'm a little confused. So we know that something happens when we do... Wait, what? Okay, so do I just click on the one that's corrupted? Okay. Oh, I, di I didn't notice the door opening. I'm sorry. Nope, let me get... Well, that happened. <laughs> what the? F oh. Was I not supposed to click that again? Damn it. here and this is the one with I forgot his name already I'm sorry oh okay let's do it again yeah So that one's just okay. Mm. 
don't think it's happening with that one. So do I just click on another one? Or no? They would attack me if I do that, right? That one's way back over tunnel? Oh, okay. I don't know why I'm struggling with this so much. I'm sorry. Yep. <laughs> I know, I know. There you are. Right this way. There we go. Yeah, I noticed. <laughs> I was a little confused by that. Voice line? I might... else to have one of these candles. That sounds like a great idea. Something needs to be done first. Great. I'm stabbing with one of these candles. Okay. Great. Nope. Great. That wasn't the answer. I don't know why, I was... <laughs> I don't know, oh, okay, up there, gotcha. I think I walked a little too far earlier. No. Bad. Do I? Okay. Shit. Where was that other candle? Oh. It's right here. No, no, that's fine. Don't worry. Okay. Shit. Where was that other candle? Do I just run back to that mirror? Or I'm just Great. I'm stabbing with one of these candles. I'm I miss Great. one of the mirrors. I'm stabbing with one of these candles. 
Yeah, it was that one that I missed, okay. Eventually I'll have it memorized so if you yeah, run. Okay. Shit. Where was that other candle? Oh, okay. <laughs> it interesting. It's the same bomb one liner there. <laughs> I know. Okay, fine, I'll read a journal. Jeez. And not the reality too. Where have I seen this before? My mind is splitting. Isn't this creature one that is familiar to me, one that I saw with Addy all those years ago? Surely it can't surely it couldn't be. <laughs> he speaks of a stolen friend. Surely he cannot mean Addy. This is absurd. I think he means right. you from afar, sleeping without a fret. I snuck into your bed, thirsty and patient. I desired your heart, lurking in droughts, and you found me in your head. No, this isn't true. I have to keep moving. Okay, so the riddle was just not related to the puzzle we did anyway, from what I noticed. Hey look, we found the other key. Oh no, that wasn't a key. <laughs> that wasn't a key at all. I was expecting to have to jump so soon. Wait. Wait a minute. This is fucking game to you. I missed. I mean, I would classify this as a game, yes. And I missed. And I forgot that there's a drop. I'm like infinitely bad at platforming games on stream. Like, infamously so. Why is it. <laughs> yeah, you know. You remember that stream. Uh, I couldn't tell where I was going. I couldn't tell if I could make it over there or not. And, okay. The game, okay, the game is not too challenging. I'm clearly just wasn't prepared for said challenge at all. <laughs> like, it's not unfairly difficult. I just 
was not prepared for this. Okay. There we go. Yeah, more of us. Alright, now what you got for me? Dear Easter Girls of IV, he is playing with me, but at what cost? It's turning deadly. Only just now have you noticed this? This thought took away to the back of my mind, and I am reminded of it every time I look at my daughter. I see so much of Addie and Lily. This is why I have to do this. I have to relinquish the mystery. For Addie. For me. And most importantly, for Lily. Because Lily is not Addie. And over sheltering her will not bring Addie back. Okay. Trying to figure out what that noise I'm hearing is. Don't mind me. Also, I don't really have much to comment about what she said there. It was just kind of sad. I also noticed that uh, our clown Spot friend was there. Playing with Addie in the streets, the grief the day we would finally meet. I silently slid my finger slow, hoping to linger into your lingo. Packing with discreet, I tittered as your family left town in retreat, passing to see you soon. I knew it had to be true. Jesus, why? That's honestly a good question. Why are you doing this to us? The visual effect there. Oh my god. I still don't know what that noise is. I couldn't figure it out. Oh, the game's not. I thought that was going to be the end of it. Okay. Riddle number four. Episode, not every door will serve. A swirling horror exhausting the light. Another passage with each door chosen right. Listen close and tight, or else your failure will be in sight. God. Not every door will serve. Another passage. Please door chosen with close and tight, or else your failure will be in sight. Okay. I can't. Okay. Oh, wait. Okay. He's chasing me from that direction. I'm trying to figure out. I'm assuming I'm doing the right thing here, right? I assume that's the first step. Okay. So 
We know those are both dead ends. I was trying to open this. I and then I didn't notice that it was a door opening earlier. Hey Doom, how you doing? So there's his hands in there. Oh. There's more door. Oh, there's more doors over here. But he comes from this way, right? That's fake, that's fake. Someone there? Right. Had to find a way to get down here. That wasn't it. Alright. You said we had the wisdom for the sound that way and only we'll open doors and like that. Okay. I am just kind of more or less just illuminating. Cause he starts chasing me as soon as I open that door specifically. Is someone there? Can't believe the dead's back seating. I mean, I knew about that. For some reason, I kind of just remember it more visually as well. That door can't be open, period. This is to ten. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just trying to figure out where's the next. So before I get him chasing me. There's clearly a door that I'm missing. Oh, I didn't pick up the... It was right here. Absurd, I'm just gonna read it again. Not every door will serve. Swirling horror exhausting the light. Another passage with each door chosen right. Listen close and tight. Or else your prey will okay. be in sight. God. Yet another room. I know uh, I also cannot jump anymore. <laughs> That's expected, but <laughs> All right, it's never those two doors.
No, that's... Okay. I thought I could, like, juke him somehow, but apparently not. So does another door spawn somewhere when I open the, or is it just, <laughs> I can see why you mean by people being frustrated by this just a little bit. So that door, that door, something appears after you open that door with the missing poser. Yeah, that's why I fought, but I haven't had time to really look because on account of being chased. That's, oh, it's right here. Okay, there we go. Gotcha, okay. Now I know what to do. Okay. Hey, princess. How are you doing today? I fought. Okay. Well, that clearly wasn't it. No. Okay. Gotcha. Kind of did that in the wrong order because they were both making that noise. The melody. I've been doing well though. I'm sorry. Just been kind of focusing on this. So the exit should have spawned somewhere, right? I okay. Yeah, it's coming for the death of all people. <laughs> I didn't notice the... Uh, I was reading chat, so I didn't notice that spawn right there. Oh. Oh, that's weird.
See, even the monster feels bad for me, and he's get now giving me a hand. Okay, no. he is literally hand holding me. <laughs> he is literally hand holding me now. I was trying to. The <laughs> case had another question. Yeah, I was. I was trying to figure out where I was hearing the melody. Not fair. Not fair. <laughs> oh well. All right. You were slightly too early for that, but I loved it. <laughs> I just love reading it first and then hearing it. <laughs> It's like when you go to a YouTube comment section and like they talk about something happening and it happens like after you read it. That's what it reminded me of. I was about to say, like, did I miss something? I didn't see it. It appeared right there. Just making sure? Okay. I have not because I don't really play many sports games to be honest. Oh, it was this one. Whoops. Now is it up here? Yeah. How many four doors am I opening? <laughs> That's my question. <laughs>
I guess I missed the sound of that earlier. My bad. Ooh, a hammer. Can we bonk the guy in the head, please? <laughs> Bye, clown man. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's fine. That was quite a bit long, though. That's alright. Ooh. Again, I really love... I really, really do love the visual aesthetics of these games, though. A lot. V has Addie. This cannot be right. Has she been down here all these years? Playing these same bullshit games I've been playing? Maybe there is hope to save her and myself. Yeah, no, I would be one to talk there. Okay. So what is this? <laughs> he appears through black and white. He plays of you in the night. Okay. Sorry, just had to hold off on this. Uh, Vasilis? Vasilis? Alright, more of the game. Uh, riddle number five. of sanity and has forsaken the core to its need when he insists you control the strings are mine to pull step closer and you will see the first try will be worth your curiosity god make it stop just go away yeah I think the one thing maybe is to make it more clear that something appears on the ground whenever you open it up enough doors or at least have it so um Vasilis doesn't chase you for the first room and maybe the second to kind of like put more pressure on the player after that's just that's just my idea because that's, that's the one thing that kind of confused me at first is that i didn't know that something i would be looking for something on the ground
It's fine, though. Oh, okay. Gotcha, gotcha. I was like playing around with that. I wasn't even paying attention. <laughs> I was moving something. <laughs> I was just having fun while idly chatting. <laughs> oh, okay. I got mixed up on which one was moving for a second there. I mean, I'm still lucky this game, though. Do not get me wrong. <laughs> That's my reaction too. No, oh, okay. Just holding my hand out and just like sheer why? Why does this add that? I totally missed something there because I wasn't looking all the way up. <laughs> it's probably gonna be the clown again. Are you leaving, Vince? Thank you for sticking by the... You've been a pleasure in chat. Look closer, I won't move. <laughs> ah, alright, fine. You're moving there, slightly. Alright, so what is this next puzzle then? <laughs> Alright, so he is staring head on there, off to the side. Then in that way. Cause I can't interact with it. Maybe the back of it? Maybe? Oh okay. Yeah. Who's that? The Nice. Why well, these speaking creatures won't let you see? Oh, the door's open now. Okay, <laughs> it's actually <exceeding> now. <laughs> no. No, no. Oh, the game's getting corrupted. Well, this is a little familiar. Oh my god, I'm fast. <laughs> yeah, that's what I said. <laughs> also, you two are adorable. 
I might add. Yeah, nothing much to see. Where is it now? Eh, not really. Oh, no. Oh, okay. I'll just go through to... <laughs> go through to put where's the light there. Where are we going? Where are we? Well, that does not answer my questions. Oh, here's the melody again. Yeah, that does not answer my question. Ready? You were my sister, you always were. Aww. How... touching. You knew the truth, but you left me. Damn. That took like a... turn. A soap right in the background. <laughs> Whatever that area is. Uh, he hurts me, Wesley, I'm scared. Ow! <laughs> Please don't leave me again. <sighs> he won't let you escape another time. Is this a choice? Do I get a choice? Let's go up. <laughs> I know. Who could have made such a hor such a horribly depressing game? <laughs> Actually, this gate, on the contrary, this part is actually very bright. <laughs> very bright. Because it is you I truly ever wanted. Well, don't I feel special? Hi, Addy. We've been hearing about you so much. Do you know how many struggles I had to go through to get to get over here? Addy. So that was a joke he was always laughing about. You will not take this from me. You will not take the only thing I know. You will not take everything. Sorry. 
Sad, buddy. He's not even looking at me, he's just staring off into space. Oh yeah, is there something else I'm supposed to be doing here? Yeah? Okay. Oh. I'm sorry. <laughs> Here, what are we going through the floor? <laughs> oh. Well, that was a little anticlimactic. I thought you would, like, I don't know, attack me or something, but no. You just hide back into the wall. Come on back out of here. You can't you can't just hide from me like this. <laughs> Not all of the time. Okay. And there will be Addy. <laughs> uh, uh, Lily. I'm I can learn to understand you much better. Fuck if I off, <laughs> Cortana. <laughs> That's what I guess for having new fans or your wireless earbuds now. Just ruining that moment entirely. <laughs> Pick up away from babysitter at mall. I'm pretty sure the babysitter was. Never mind. Ah, uh, she missed it. Or maybe she didn't. <laughs> Fuck you! <laughs> it's gonna be Addy, isn't it? Or not Addy, sorry, Lily. I know. <laughs> no. No. Bad. Finally! Finally the, the game knows what I want. Yeah? Yeah? Nope. <laughs> you ain't doing shit. I have a gun. And there's nothing you can do about it. 
Except for that, apparently. <laughs> Never mind, he did something about it. <laughs> so, like, did he appear behind me or something there? I'm assuming he did. From puzzles to doom. Like I said, the game knows what I wanted. I have to appreciate that. Ah, uh, see, he does appear, but I could, I could like barely see him there. Just run? Okay. Fair enough. Gotcha. I guess let's do that. I thought I had to like kill all of them. I got you. I got you, you And uh backseating again a little bit. That's fine. Oh, so it was slightly... Oh. Really? Okay, never mind. It, it is a little bit more dark than I thought it was. <laughs> I did. I fully expected it. Wait, was that the gun I was holding? Have I already dropped it? A memory of Alex Smith. Clown bastard is still alive. <gasps> oh, 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 okay. Um, <laughs> we kind of fancy. I, I know. The fun little ending song. Which, on that note, I really love these little songs that you guys do. I'm gonna go back to the menu though. Just to just because I'm like excited to see first off the other ending and congrats and now I can go for the other ending and also use the black key just for some extras. Okay. Let's do the other ending first, I think. Um, which one was the Which is the chapter for it? Is it um this ends now? I'm assuming. Or is it Home Sweet Home?
Okay. I'm just making sure. I kind of read that after. I just thought that this ends now would start with the... Like, immediately with the choice that you're given. When Visea was attacks you in the house. That's all. I forgot about the mall part when I called the um, upper ending out. So I bet after this whole experience, Wesley still doesn't believe a thing. This is as fake as Bigfoot, right? <laughs> Everybody's jiggling. <laughs> Alright, let's cut ourselves. Oh. All right. Um. No. It's a trick. And it? This is the only way. Ow. Sounds <laughs> you better believe she shot all those people. <laughs> yeah. Wait, was there another no, ending to that? Really. This or does that just go back to the prior choice? It goes back to your original choice. That's why I thought. I was just making sure before I move on to the black key. Do we kill ourselves or kill a bunch of people, daughter included, and then ourselves? Yeah. <laughs> the cell is not turned off, so we are turning that on. Uh, select level, the drive. I'm assuming it would be all the way to 40 for dimensions, right? Alright. Yeah. Oh no, we're going back in the boat, right? Okay. I'll tell everyone we would start up. Peekaboo. This Vassal's guy is a mean son of a bitch, huh? Just a little bit. So, where would the black key be? I thought it would be next to the letter. Or do I have it on me? Maybe? Yeah, okay. Gotcha. Yeah, I just followed that. How do you know your mind is your own? Grasp onto memories. The key will save you from your current state. But nothing about this is okay. It's like every part of reality that I've ever known has been ripped from me. The 
every truth I've ever known has been ripped from me. Now, I sit and I wonder, what, what am I going to do about this? Uh, apparently this. We're going to do this is about it. Yep. I wanted to take a, another look at that. Because I love it. Love things like that. Oh, we're going up here. All right, cool. Nothing over there. All right. Just had to look. Okay, well, I guess we'll just walk around it this way. That's fair. Yep. So where does the hat come in, is my question. Or is it something that I missed? Yeah, I know. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a very important question. All right. That was fun. Oh, that's the um the tree. Yeah. Okay. I didn't even pick up on that. Thanks for playing. That's pretty much it. But you can see the hat on the rest of the cutscenes, and now you can also choose another new build and extras. Oh, okay. Well, let's look at that first. Doo doo mode. Oh, oh, uh, <laughs> doop doo mode. Sorry. <laughs> I didn't read the P in the first one. Do we start from the beginning? Yeah, let's start from the beginning. This is this is clearly this was clearly what I needed for this. I love it. <laughs> Exactly, because yes. It's like when I was looking at the um the extras for a Dia though when I played it. You got on ten? Yep. So I'll call it that with this game. It was a lot of fun though. Thank you. Like I said, I think for that one puzzle, it was a... Uh... Aside from that one puzzle, at first, when I did get it, you know, it was a lot more easier after that. It was a lot of fun. Oh yeah, and 
Also, my platform ring failing failure. We're not gonna talk about that though. It's fine. We don't need to. Yeah, both games were an absolute joy to play. You're welcome. And I don't think there's anything more that I have to say about this game in particular that I have already said. Like I said, but the one thing is, like, I just absolutely love this scenery as we go along this, though. And I'm more quieter. <laughs> but it's more quieter as well. Um, and I'm looking forward to them to invite us. I, I, I'm not providing the sound effects for that. Oh, there it is. I was I was waiting to we see the hat. I love how small it is. <laughs> Alright. She's kind of tiny. I know. I was expecting it to be like as big as his. Was that always there? This is my question. <laughs> Was that always there? As soon as I tried to wrap up, <laughs> it was there. It was foreshadowing all along. <laughs> like, oh, I tried to wrap up and now I'm just stuck here talking more <laughs> because of how hilarious this is. Uh, but that'll do it for uh, Cave Evolution. Now I get to finally close the game. And I think I'll also end the stream here, actually. As well. I thought we'd be playing for longer and such, but... No problem. I did... I do plan on playing um, some more of your games sometime soon, but I just wanted to... I just wanted to call this off for now. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, to be fair, that's true. Alright, and thank you everyone for tuning in, and I hope you all have a good night.